Welcome to Math Alive. Our lesson for today is basic constructions in geometry using a straight edge and a compass. Construction number one, copy a line segment. We will copy line segment AB. First, we construct a ray CE and then measure the length of line segment AB using this compass. With a compass point on point A, we will swing an R to B. And then, we will copy this R from point C and intersect the, the ray CE at point D. So, AB is congruent to CD. You can copy another segment on the same ray from D and then we have CD is congruent to DE. The second construction is copy an angle. To copy the angle CAB, we start by making a ray DE and then measure um, a convenient arc from point A. So from point A, we swing an arc intersecting at both sides of the angle. So we intersect the angle A at point B and point C. Or we can make a big arc like that. And then from point B, you also make a big arc or swing an arc. intersecting DE at E. Then we will measure the arc BC by the opening of this compass. So with the compass point at point B, we will adjust the compass and swing an arc at C. Okay, this is exactly at C. And then, from point E, we move the compass point and swing an arc at F. Then, we will connect the F. Therefore, angle CAB is congruent to angle FDE. We have copied the angle. Next is construction number three. Bisect an angle. Given an angle CAB, we will bisect the angle by first swinging an arc from point A. Okay, we can adjust the opening of the compass, and then swing an R. So the angle A is um, the angle A, the sides of the angle was intersected at B and C, and then from point B, you swing an R at the interior and then from point C swing another arc intersecting the first arc then connect A and B the point of inter intersection of the two arcs
So we have bisected angle A. And we see that angle BAD is congruent to angle DAC. Next is construct a perpendicular line from an external point to a line. The external point here is point P. And then the line is line AD. So from point P, we adjust the opening of the compass and uh, swing an arc to a little bit um, lower than the line. And then we're going to intersect line AB at two points, at A and at B. And then from point A, we swing an arc below the line And then from point B, we swing another arc below the line, intersecting at point C. So P and C will be connected. So the line PC is the perpendicular line to this line AB. And the last construction is construct a perpendicular bisector of a line segment. So line segment AB will be bisected. Okay. With a compass point at point A, we adjust the opening of the compass to a little bit more than half of the segment AB. And then we swing an arc above the line and below the line. Then from point B, the compass point will be placed at B. We swing an arc with the same opening as the, the arc from point A. And then we connect the points of intersection C and D. Then the line CD is the perpendicular bisector of the segment AB because it cuts the line segment AB at its midpoint. So we say AM is congruent to MB and CD is perpendicular, making a right angle at the foot of the perpendicular. These constructions can be used in your projects in geometry, and your constructions, even in your ordinary drawings. I use them in my own drawings too, and I enjoy it a lot. Thank you very much for listening, and if you find this helpful, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to this channel by clicking the buttons below.